Hey YouTube, what's up? This is Puck. This is for my Mac users. If you're on a Mac, you know, like an iMac, just like this one here behind me, you know, then uh, if you want to record music, let's say for instance, uh, you have an old cassette uh, here, you know, and you want to record the cassette to um, the iMac, you know, the music, then you know you must uh, you you should know that then you must connect uh, the the cable to the output I hope you can see it because I'm, I'm not I'm not, not even seeing what I'm showing you but there and then you connect it to the second uh, hole in your iMac and then of course you must go to sound settings and then change uh, the microphone built into uh, the line in and then you know the sound will come in but then you won't hear anything you know but with the program called um, how you call it I'm recording here with a program I forgot what its name oh yeah it's named ice cream ice cream so you know you can download I ice cream and then install it but then it will record for you but you won't hear anything and to hear something you know to hear something then you must uh, get this program and this program my friend is called line in it's called line in I will put the link uh, later on for you guys because uh, I'm recording this with my iPhone but I just thought it was really handy to show you uh, how to hear the sound uh, you're recording uh, on your iMac while recording it because eh? it's yeah This is an old, uh, a old uh, concert I had somewhere and I found the tape. I was just uh, cleaning out my studio. As you can see, I'm still busy. And uh, I found a lot of old tapes. And yeah, I want to uh, put them uh, in a digital format so I can put them on the internet or, you know, burn a CD or whatever do with it. Just, you know, for the good old times because this tape is <laughs> 21 years old it's unbelievable 23 years old and i'm recording it now straight to my imac you know so that is really 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 cool i was so young here when i was having this concert so unknown <laughs> Anyway, um, what I'm doing now, I'm just uh, recording uh, audio and for those that didn't, didn't know how to uh, record audio, you know, audio recording is uh, something that I did uh, when I started out with computers because, you know, I created music and at that time uh, it was really expensive to burn a CD, you know, if you wanted to burn a CD, it costed like 200 guilders, some guy was doing it, you know. So we needed a computer with a good sound card, you know, and I remember way back in 96, I had a Pentium 1 with 120 megahertz, you know, and the thing was, uh, how you call it, recording music for me. And then I'm going to show you, I'm, I'm, I'm busy here in the studio. And then, oops, if I can show it to you. Oh, and then... I would like the music I recorded would then uh, be uh, burnt with this beautiful scusi scusi burner from uh, from AP. It was the AP Sure Store 6020. Look at that man! This thing is vintage. This this thing is so old. It's 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 unbelievable. I still have it. I paid like almost 1200 guilders for this thing so i'm like i don't want to throw it away you know because it's still nice so that's what that's how i started out and you know recording music to your windows machine is much easier because you can just select the line in and everything that you connect to the line in will start playing over your speakers but with the mac it's it's different you know you must have brains to use mac so that's why we uh advise you i advise you to use the program called line in and that will let you hear if you hit pass through it will pass through the sound so you will have uh yeah
my band was pretty good at that time, Top Secret, that was the name of my band, <laughs> yeah, but uh, my friends, that's how to do it, so if you also have a Mac and you're like wondering, how, to, how can I record music, straight in, hard disk recording, they call it hard disk recording, how can we do some hard disk recording, some music hard disk recording, how can we put uh, all those old, old tapes back uh, where they belong, you know, on a good place, uh, on CD, because now you ha you are your own record company, so you don't have to worry too much about copyrights, it's your own stuff, right? So, I wish you a pleasant weekend once more, and uh, I hope you now know how to get your music passed through with Line Out. <laughs>